an elegant PC user interface to make Skyrim more pleasant to navigate, a mod configuration menu for mods that utilize it, and some fixes to make it all even better. Welcome to Gamer Poets. The only requirement that SkyUI has is SKSE, and if you need help with it, watch my video on how to install it and to test that it's working. Open the linked mod page, open files, download it to your mod manager, activate it. That's it. In years past, the faux mod installer that comes with SkyUI, for reasons unknown, has given some MO2 users problems. If it won't install to MO2, try downloading SkyUI manually. Put it on your desktop. Extract the archive. Delete the faux mod. Highlight the remaining files. Repack them into a new archive. Name it SkyUI. Now install it. For more help, I have videos on how to use archive programs and some other modding tips. When you have a lot of save game entries, you may experience a bug where this menu reloads multiple times. This mod fixes that. Open the flashing Save Games Fix page. Download the main file, install it, and activate it. You may come across other mods that have integrated this fix. If you use any of those mods, you don't need this, but it doesn't hurt to install it anyways. Just let those other mods overwrite this one. SkyUI's item cards are not very OCD friendly. Item card fixes adjust the spacing so that every card lines up together. Open the item card fixes mod page. Download and install the main file. An installer will open. If you have the mod Frostfall installed, these are your options to choose from. If you don't, then these are your options. Font Overhaul, Soften Guard, and Enderall are mods that change the game's font. If you use one of them, choose the appropriate option. If you don't, choose Default Item Card Fixes. Install. Activate. Since the release of Special Edition, Notes and books have used the same icon. However, notes are supposed to have their own. This mod fixes that. First, you need to have address library installed. Many of you have this already, and you should. It stops game updates from breaking SKSE mods that utilize it. I have an address library video for those of you who need help with it. With address library installed, open the fixed note mod page. Download the latest version from the main files. There are currently separate options for Anniversary Edition owners and Special Edition, so be sure to select the correct one. Install the mod, activate it. If you have ever encountered an issue where upgrading or dropping an item that was in your SkyUI Favorites group makes it and similar items no longer equipable, this mod fixes that. Open the Ghost Item Bug Fix page. Files, download, install, activate. Why did I write saying something about, I just can't bring myself to talk about subscribe and like and share. And if you found this video useful, hit that like. No, I, I no. If you found the video helpful, like, share, and blah, 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 blah. I hate that crap. If you found this video useful, smash that like button. You sound stupid even trying to say it. Gina's even over there laughing at me. Now it's coming back to me. Anyways, thanks for hanging out with me.